Hey everybody, welcome to my Halloween costume 2013. This is the greatest brush I have encountered in ZBrush. Okay, so let's get to it. Uh, let's start with a new scene, Sphere 3D, just like I did with uh, this guy. Let's look at the costume. This is going to scare everybody. Everybody's going to run the other way. This took me 10 minutes. Pretty cool. Okay, so let's go back to the sphere we were just working with. Uh, press F to frame it. And let's see, dynam or make dynam poly mesh 3D. Okay, that brings it down here. Now we can work with this great brush. To select it, press B, curve, so C, then A. That gives us the curve lathe brush, and this is really, really cool. So let's make something. Okay, that gives us this long thing. We can adjust the way it looks just by moving this this line around. It lathes or wraps geometry around in a circular-like fashion, and we can make anything we want. Anything we want to. Okay, this, you can adjust your draw size to have to select a bigger area, select the green lines to move where it is, okay, then rotate in your scene just to move it around, okay, it doesn't have to look perfect, okay, then control, click and drag um, to deselect it and make sure Dynamesh is on so it can Dynamesh to the object below, just like that. So now we can make a, this is our head, this is our neck, now let's make a body. So crazy lines all over the place. Okay, it looks crazy at first, but if you move things around, you can make anything you want to. Really, really easy, quickly, what a great tool. Okay, rotate, move, nice, okay. Okay, there's our body. Now let's make some arms. So, draw a line, and then squiggles. Okay, I like the way that looks, so I'm going to move it into the mesh so we can deselect everything and then dynamesh it to what we have. Okay, then do the same thing on the other side. Perfect. Now you can move the use the move, scale, and rotate um, commands up here with what you're working on in edit mode. So you can move it around, scale it, okay, make it smaller, uh, or just move it around, and then go back to your draw and deselect everything and. Uh, dynamesh it to your scene. This is the best brush. I was able to make this really quickly. Um, I didn't have any design sheet or anything to work with him. I just slowly sculpted him using what we have been showing in this video. So, one more thing. Okay. That doesn't look too great. Let's make some legs. Okay, there's one foot. Deselect Dynamesh. Working, working. Okay, then this side. Side. Okay, move it around. Let's see. Yeah, perfect. Now, if I move this, it's going to... Oh, that's not too bad. Yeah, yeah it is. Uh, let's use the move tool. So move it. Okay, now it's part of it. So deselect, dynamesh. Isn't this the greatest tool ever? Then you can apply materials to whatever you're working on and all sorts of craziness. If anybody else likes this video or wants to see more, please subscribe and uh, comment below. Thanks everybody.